guys and welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new my name is Morgan and today I'm going to be sharing with you my top options for what to get your guy for Christmas now this list is for the guy who like pretty much already has everything and who's very difficult to buy for someone who also likes luxury items the items on this list are tried and tested items that my fiance Ronnie has in his daily life and uses frequently he already has everything he needs so finding options that will be a nice surprise for the holidays is quite difficult. There are probably more of you ladies out there who have a difficult time shopping for guys because there just isn't as much to buy for them as there is for girls. But I'm hopefully going to give you some creative ideas today and also some classics because you can never go wrong with a classic item. So let's get into it. I'm going to start with quite a classic item, a usual stocking stuffer, a cologne. I wanted to give you a luxury option that you can customize. So recently, Ronnie picked up this Louis Vuitton cologne and the nice thing about it, he hasn't done it yet, but you can put your initials or an important date on here. This is also great if you've got an important occasion coming up and you want something that reminds your man of that date, but I think this is such a lovely gift for guys because this, I don't know what it is, but it smells great to me, which is the important thing. You want to get a cologne that you like to smell on your guy, but also that he'll like to wear. It's a very masculine scent. This is the Ombre Nomad. They have multiple options for the scents, but this is the one that they said is the most popular, or at least that's what my sales associate told me. And I think it's such a lovely option because I don't know why, it just smells like Louis Vuitton to me. I think a lot of the guys who work there also wear this, so maybe that's why it smells like Louis Vuitton to me. But this is a gorgeous option that you can customize. If your guy already has a standard cologne, this could just up that level a little bit. The next item I have is a very classic loafer from Gucci. These, every man needs a loafer in his work wardrobe. Gucci makes probably the most classic option. They've been around the 70s, the 50s. They've been around for forever. And the great thing about it is, is every season there are new color options and sometimes different fabric options too. If your guy has a standard brown and black option, you can also go for an evening loafer. It's a black velvet option. The G's are imprinted in it and they're absolutely gorgeous. They're perfect for occasions and evening wear and they're never gonna go out of style. That's the thing about a Gucci loafer. It's timeless, it's worth the investment. I have a pair of the women's one myself and I wear them all the time. They're super comfortable to walk in. They elevate any outfit for men and women, so I think this is a great option to get your guy. If your guy already has his work shoes sorted and you just wanna elevate his casual wear, go for a designer pair of sneakers. It's just such a great way that if your guy already has everything, you can upgrade his trainers to something a little more chic. What I love about the Gucci ones is that they come in so many different designs and colorways, but they also have the classic one pretty much always in stock. So you can get this without like the dragon on here. And you can also get them with the stripes where it's red and blue. So if you don't want like the red and green going on, there are options for that as well. If your guy doesn't like to wear like fancy clothes on the weekends, and he's just a t-shirt and jeans kind of guy, this is the perfect gift for him to just elevate his outfit with no extra effort. He can still wear his t-shirt and jeans and just put on a clean, beautifully made sneaker that stands the test of time. These have been around for many seasons now and Gucci continues to do them. So again, it's a great investment for a shoe. And yeah, I just think these are a beautiful option. Also another shoe that if you like to match with your guy, they make women's versions. I have a pair as well and Ronnie and I wear them out together sometimes. The reason why I love Golden Goose is like if you're not into showing off what designer you're wearing, if you don't know the brand Golden Goose, it's not necessarily visible. So like Gucci is quite a recognizable brand with the green and the red stripe, but with Golden Goose, like I'll be quite honest, I didn't know who they were until Ronnie started wearing them. And this is definitely more for the dress down look. They come already distressed. And if your guy doesn't really like like the bougie kind of designer items, but he already has everything he needs and you just wanna like elevate it up a little bit, you could go for a golden goose for a more casual sneaker. It doesn't scream designer. And some guys really appreciate that. So these also, again, come in several colors. 
Golden Goose's signature is this classic star. It's a little bit more subtle, and I think it's a great option for that guy who really isn't into designer things, but appreciates quality because they are comfortable shoes that are well made. I have one more pair of shoes for you and then I'll move on to some other options, but this last option is really for the guy who literally has everything and you have no idea what to get him. And he's got his loafers, he's got his sneakers sorted, and then you're just like, okay, so if I wanna get a pair of shoes, what do I get him? Some designer slides. Now, I'll admit, I think these are completely ridiculous <laughs> in terms of the fact that you really don't have to spend so much money on slides. You can get an Adidas pair and Nike pair that are great, but if your guy has everything, he's into designers, and especially here, like I find in the Middle East and Asia, we remove our shoes when we go into people's houses. These are a great option if you don't like to walk around barefoot but you don't wear outside shoes in your home. You could keep these just as your inside shoes. They're comfortable, you can walk around, you have something on your feet, and they're not hot. Growing up I had house slippers, like fuzzy slippers in the US. But when I moved to Dubai, like fuzzy slippers just make your feet sweat and that's not cute. And I also don't always wanna walk around barefoot so a pair of slides is a great option for inside the house that don't make your feet sweat. And you know, they're pretty chic. These are the Versace ones. They come in several colors, I know. Every season they do different patterns, different colors. The style originated from sportswear brands. I'll admit some designers, their quality, like when you feel them, feel exactly like the sportswear brands. But I will say these Versace, you can feel a difference in the sole bed of them and the materials used on top. So I highly recommend taking a look at Versace for them. I know the Gucci ones are super trendy. If your guy is into logos, check out Gucci for the slides. I saw Louis Vuitton has a pair this season, but they're stupid expensive, so I don't know that I can fully give my recommendation, but if your guy is obsessed with Louis Vuitton and you've got the budget, go for it. There is one item I don't have with me because they never leave Ronnie's side, so it's AirPods. So yes, you can get the standard white AirPods, but I found a company here in Dubai that does custom color, so I got him matte black. It's still the Apple technology, you're not getting a knockoff brand, you're getting actual Apple AirPods that are customized to be different colors. I think it's probably the best gift I've ever given him because it's the one he uses the most. He would not relinquish them for this video because he constantly has to have them. The rest of the stuff he kindly let me borrow to show you guys. If your guy's a techie, I will link some options below of where you can get these like customized things. Next item I have is a classic, and it's a belt. I'm sure your guy probably already has a belt, but if you're just looking to elevate his look a little bit, or add a designer piece to his closet, if he doesn't have designer already, a belt is a great way to introduce a guy into designer items. It also might be something special he wouldn't normally buy for himself, but he would appreciate to have because they're durable classics. I'm going to talk you through a couple of my favorite options. This is what I'll say about belts before we start. The brand you go with will heavily depend on what color hardware you like and also what logos you like. A lot of belts are just the designer like monogram or logo as the buckle. Maybe what you can do is pick the brand that is his favorite or some brands also have classic options where the name is just written on the side of the buckle, like a little bit more classic, and it's not a logo belt. We'll start with Ferragamo. And why I love Ferragamo is that I feel like this buckle is a little more classic. This is for the guy who loves gold. I think they have a silver option as well. But what I absolutely love is that you can switch the belt. You have brown on one side and black on the other. So it's like you're getting two belts in one. And I think this is such a classy look for work. You can go for a more subdued hardware, but Ronnie loves gold, his watch is gold, and his accessories are gold. Oh, that's another tip. If your guy does wear a watch, pay attention to the color of his watch and match the buckle to the color of his watch. So Ronnie prefers gold and his watch is gold. So most of these I'm showing you are gold, but a lot of the designers have silver and gold options in the same belt. Of course, we're back to Gucci. Gucci just does such great men's stuff. And what I like about them, especially for men's, is that they give classic options every season and also trendy options. So if you want a more subdued gold, the Gucci Marmont GG is a nice option. I personally, this is not an option I love on like me or on girls in general. 
but for some reason as a guy's belt, the Gucci Marmont logo, I think it's kind of nice because it's a little more subtle and then the sizing of it they did really well too. Now this is not a reversible belt but I think it is very versatile because this can go for work if you need it to be more subtle but also this dresses up a casual outfit. So I think this is a beautiful option. They do come in multiple colors, they do different colors each season so you can just take a look and see like what color would be great for your guys wardrobe. This next belt I have is also from Gucci but it's not one that you see often because most people want that big Gucci GG. This is more of your work appropriate belt that it's almost so subtle that you can't even tell from far away it's like a G. It almost just looks like an interesting belt buckle. So I really like this for a guy who has a job where he doesn't want to show off his logos but he wants a quality made belt that's gonna last him years. Okay, so this video is for the guy who has everything. So suppose your guy already has his work belts, already has his casual belts. What about his like evening belt or like dressy belt? This is the Versace belt. This is the smaller Medusa head one. I They come like bigger, which then it gets a little too gaudy for me, but this I think is such a lovely evening belt. I would not recommend this as like a work appropriate belt. It's a little much. It's a little flashy. If your guy already has that covered and you're looking for something a little more unique, this could be a really cool option. This is technically not a designer item, but it's something that helps you take care of your designer items. So I know guys typically don't want extra effort and designer items can take more care. Well, to make it as easy as possible, these Jason Mark quick wipes are amazing. They almost look like a little hand towels that someone would give you at a restaurant, but they're just a soft wipe that have two different sizes. One has little dots for tougher stains. This is a great stocking stuffer to get your guy if you're gonna go for getting him like a designer sneaker. This will help him keep his sneakers clean and it's super easy to use. So the very last item I have might not be for every guy, but hear me out first because it is life changing. So, I think it's been maybe about a year now. Um, Ronnie now carries like a pouch. And these are so great because like if your guy likes skinny jeans or he just, if he's the type that when you sit down at a restaurant, everything comes out of the pocket so he can be comfortable, this will change his life. This is just great to keep your like phone, keys, wallet, valet ticket, um, AirPods, just all compact, it's slim. You know, you just kind of carry it like this. You can put this on the table when you sit down in a restaurant and everything doesn't look messy. This will also make your clothes look so much better too because have you ever seen a guy wearing like skinny jeans or like straight pants that are more fitted and then his pockets are bulging everywhere? This fixes that. Some guys might see it as a purse but honestly it's like a functional item and it's a pouch. This is a men's item. This is from the Louis Vuitton men's line and they come in different shapes and sizes. So if your man uses an iPad for work or like you know he's just addicted to his iPad, we're actually looking for a bigger one for Ronnie right now that can fit his like iPad in it plus all of his stuff that he would normally put in his pockets because this has been such a great functional item for him that now he's expanding his collection. This would be my number one recommendation for a men's pouch because it's super durable. It's made out of Louis Vuitton canvas, which is super indestructible. Guys are typically, from my experience, not very careful with their things. They don't want to be fussy. So this he can throw on the table, you know, in the car, wherever. It's not going to get abused easily. So you don't have to worry about it if your guy is a rough user of his things. You can get him this knowing with confidence how durable it is. If you want some other options, I've got a few more because now Ronnie likes it so much he has kind of a collection of them. I borrowed most of his collection for this video. So this is another great one. This one's from Burberry. This is if you want something that's a little more stable. This one can stand up on the table. And this one's nice because like if he's on the phone, he can literally hold it like this be on the phone and it's like easy or even hold it by like put the strap around his wrist and be hands free. This is like for your guy on the go. This is one he uses quite frequently for work because when he's going here and there for meetings it's important not to have to fuss with something and for him to just have the ease of use. Another option that I think is great for work or casual, it's coming up a little green on screen but it's not, it's like a tan color. Um, this is a Versace one. The logo is super tiny, 
so there's just a little designer detail and on the back it's completely plain so if your guy doesn't want logos or doesn't want the branding loud this is a great option again it has a, the strap so it's super easy to use but you can also remove the strap too it can be held in the hand or it can be put on the wrist so I think this is a nice option if your guy is not into like a black color or not into logos. Now if your guy is already into pouches, if you want to expand his collection to something a little more fun, Versace does some amazing prints. Same style, removable strap, it's the thin pouch, and this one's like um, I think it's like a nylon material. It has like the classic Versace print. This one is not one I would recommend for work. If he already has something like a briefcase that he takes to and from work, this is a great casual bag. Ronnie uses this like on the weekends or in the evenings. So yeah, if he's already got a little bit of a collection of small leather goods, then you know one of these might be kind of fun. Thank you guys so much for watching and I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope it was helpful for you. I find it super hard to buy for guys, so maybe I've given you some tips. I tried to give you some options that even if he has the classic version, you could find a little fun twist and maybe add to his collection. I hope I also gave you some introductory items if you want to start a designer collection for your man. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and also follow me on Instagram where I post more fashion content. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye!